back in my kitchen again because today I want to make something for you guys. Today we're going to be making mozzarella sticks. I want to be trying these. Um, I've always wanted to try to make these and um, also something else like the um, onion rings also but that'll be another video. So today with four ingredients, four little things I'm going to be making the mozzarella sticks, yay! Yes, first we're going to be using eggs, we're going to be using the seasoned um, breadcrumbs, and we're going to be using some string cheese, okay? These are the low moisture part skin mozzarella cheese, okay? So yes, that's the four things we're going to be using to make the mozzarella sticks. So we're going to need a plate, we're going to take at least, let's try with two eggs, okay, let's try two, you know what, let's try three, alright, let's put that to the side, I hope everyone is having an amazing day, let's tackle. Tuesday, but not in my house. I already cooked baby ziti today. So, and it's only like what? 1 o'clock, 12 30. I already cooked very early. So now I want to try this. You know what? I'm going to add just a little bit of salt. No, I'm going to add a little bit of garlic and salt, okay? You can try whatever you want in your kitchen, my angels. This is how I'm going to try it. Not too much because remember the cheese contains salt. And the uh, breadcrumbs is seasoned. So, you know, it's just a force of habit. I always like to season my stuff. At least with a little bit of something. <laughs> yes. Just how it is in this house. Okay, now we're going to put some of the cornbread in here. Okay, I have these cornbreads for a little while, so we're going to have to work around it. Okay, there we go. That should be more than enough. I'm just gonna break it up just like so. Okay, I'm gonna put it in there. And on the side, you're going to have a plate just so you put um, put on your mozzarella sticks when you start preparing them, okay? So we're going to have a plate on the side right here. I'm going to put it right there. I'm going to open up the mozzarella sticks. I don't want to make this video too long, but I didn't want to skip any parts. I want you to see how I'm, exactly how I'm making these. So we're gonna use some of that. Okay, let's just unpack for now. Okay. Let's just this one go. So bam, so it's no problem. So we're gonna do, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna put a few in there first before I start preparing them. Just because they're trying to play with me over here so now okay my angels now I have all my cheeses here there you go. so now I have all the cheese I'm gonna make um eight of them all right so this is done let me just leave it there okay I already have the pan I'm gonna fry them in sorry about that noise I'm gonna put the oil over here Okay, so I'm gonna grab. I'm not gonna need this fork, at least not for now. I'm gonna put it in here. Okay, something simple that I wanna try, see if it works this way. 
I haven't looked at my videos. I don't know if they use other stuff for it. But this is the way I'm going to try it. So look out. <laughs> you know, Abby's Kitchen is always inventing something, my angels. I believe you could probably use even flour for this just to make the breading stick better but this is how I'm going to make them okay so now we're gonna take a plate and you're gonna start putting these on there okay meanwhile I'm going to put some oil on my pan start heating that up okay this. Same process. All over. All over. You keep the same process until all is done, okay? And then you're gonna fry them. Okay, so here they are. All right. Make sure the oil is hot when you're gonna make these. Time. Okay, I'm going to take this other glove off. 